Hi guys, my name is Lily. I'm the education assistant here at MOLA. And today we're gonna teach you guys something that is perfect for the holidays. I know you guys might have some like free time now. You guys might wanna keep the little ones busy right now that they have vacations. So we're gonna teach you guys something really simple and really easy you guys could do at home. We don't really have snow in Southern California, but that's okay, we're gonna make the snow today. To start off, we're just gonna start off with some of the materials. First thing you need, really sturdy paper. I'm using watercolor paper. If you guys don't have that at home, you could just supplement it by using several sheets of paper kind of stacked together. You need some salt, some glue, preferably white glue, a watercolor palette. This is kind of optional, but it's cool to add color to this, you know, make it your own. A paintbrush, which is included in here, a ruler, and a pencil. So we're gonna start like this. So we're gonna get our paper and our ruler and our pencil, and we're gonna sketch out a snowflake. I'm gonna sketch a quick little snowflake, just really fast. It's not gonna be really perfect, but that's okay, no snowflake is perfect either. So next step, you're gonna get the glue. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna trace over all of your lines. The good thing about this type of glue is that it washes off. It might be a little bit messy, so if you have little ones, parents, or guardians, you guys could just watch over them. But again, it washes off. You could add a little bit more if you need it, like in the center. Play with it a little bit. So now for the fun part. So with this, you're going to have your salt container and you're going to have to just sprinkle it all over. You just pour salt all over it. This will get messy. I will warn you of that. So you could just shake it around, get it all over. Again, it will be messy. You could pour some on your hand or in a bowl and you're just gonna pour it back on. The very important step is that you're gonna have to really let this dry. If not, it's gonna be really, really, really squishy. This is a quick example of kind of what it looks like when you've completed it. Now, for the sake of time, specifically drawing, drawing time. I made one kind of earlier, as you could tell, this is a template. So as you guys could tell, this is my finished product. So after you finish letting it like, dry overnight, this is what you're gonna have. So you guys could always keep it like that, you know, if you want it to look like a traditional snowflake, but it's always fun. Kind of make it colorful, play with it a bit. So we're gonna get our water cup and our watercolor palette and our paintbrush. I'm gonna dip it in here and you guys could pick any color you guys like. And we're just gonna put it right here on the snowflake. Could mix and match the colors. You could see it kind of spread out a bit. There you go, some pinks. I'm gonna do just as much color as I can. Some blue, there you see it kind of spread a bit. Some green. It's like a tie-dye snowflake. Mm -hmm. And as you guys could tell, you guys could play with all the colors you guys want. It's really fun to watch it kind of spread everywhere too. And there you see a very colorful snowflake. A 
again, you guys could play with whatever you guys want to do. Play with the colors. Make a gradient. Just make it your own. So again, even though we don't have snow really here in Southern California, you can make your own. And this is our little finished product. So our little colorful snowflake, this is perfect right now that it's a holiday season and you guys can make like holiday cards out of it actually. Just put your snowflakes, write happy holidays. It's a multi-use thing or you guys could just use it and have fun. You guys can make multiple, make little designs, just play with it a little bit. Thank you so much for watching guys. If you guys are interested in more workshops such as this, you could head on to our website at mola.org slash events to find out about any of our upcoming workshops that we have going on every single month. Thank you, bye.